What's up guys, I'm Michelle Marie and you are tuned in to Clever Music. We had Anjali in studio to chat about her new single, Brand New Bitch. Find out more about her inspiration behind the song and video in this next clip. Talk about this new record that you have out. I know that you said that you wrote and produced, you wrote all the all the lyrics, you wrote all the songs, yeah. correct? Yeah. But you worked with other producers. Yeah. So who did who did you work with and collab with on the album? Um, I worked with kind of amazing producers. I worked with uh, Swedish House Mafia, um, Benny Benassi, Laidback Luke, a lot of European producers. One uh, guy named Jonas Gerberg, who uh -huh. was amazing, and we did half the record together. And um, yeah, it was a, it was it's a very sort of global pop record. I like that. Yeah. How would you describe the difference between working with the several producers that you just mentioned? Like Benny Benassi, he's out of this world. I, I know. know. Like anything he touches turns to like yeah platinum. So what is it like getting in the room with like the different guys that you worked with? It's really cool. I mean, I've had some really crazy stories and some really amazing ones and uh -huh. some ones that you'd be like, what? Yeah. <laughs> but um, yeah, it's just been really like a learning process, you mm -hmm. know? And like, um, as a like female in the music industry, it, it, it's, a, it's sort of like a, a challenge, I would say. Yeah. So I really sort of just like figured out what like really what my what I want to say and mm -hmm. sort of like the people and energies around me that I need to sort of help me say that. Right. So when you step into a room with a producer that you might, I mean, do you have any chemistry, chemistry with them or you might not know, how do you kind of create the, what's your strategy to like creating the creative process, I guess you would say, when you're in the studio with someone? Um, a lot of the time I just go in, I'm, I'm sort of like an insular person in terms of writing. I really mm -hmm. like to be in my own space. So I'll usually just go in the vocal booth, turn off all the lights, mm -hmm. you know, make sure that nobody can see me, all the weird faces that I make when I come up with stuff. But and and I'll just like freestyle, and it's pretty soon I'll get over the fact that there's somebody listening. Uh huh. Cause, and I'll just kind of get in my own head. In your own zone. Yeah. And then they just like bring their madness to it as well. Yeah, exactly. Create, create a masterpiece, pretty much. Yeah, so. yeah. Totally. Now, um, with the single Boom, a lot of people know you from that single yeah. uh, a few years ago. You actually were nominated for an MTV Video Music Award for Breakthrough yeah. uh, Video, right? Yeah. What was that experience like for you? I mean, that was like one of your major hits and you had just, you know, came out. It was an amazing experience. Yeah. I mean, like that show to me, like I remember seeing Michael Jackson perform um, like a medley of songs yeah. at the, on the VMAs and I was like sitting by the TV like glued <laughs> to it like, oh my God, I need to do this. Yeah. So the ultimate ultimate would be to open that show, like to open the VMAs. Oh, I think that that's like the biggest platform. Sure. Yeah. Um, but to go there. It was incredible. And just to be on stage or even just be nominated and be yeah. part of the show, that must have been incredible. Thanks for watching. If you want to see more of my interview with Anjali, be sure to sub our channel below. And to keep up with the latest taps in the studio, don't forget to follow us on Twitter and Facebook at Clever Music. I'm Michelle Marie, and I'll see you guys soon.